So Sima has been smashing my brother, right? So then my brother, like, is just like a normal guy that, like, just does whatever with every girl whenever she wants. So she felt entitled while Mutu Obizili ghost. I get to mean nigga. A ghost doesn't mean nigga. What's the dumbest thing you ever did for love? The dumbest thing I've ever did for love, yeah. Uh, the dumbest thing I've ever did for love was giving a hand the benefit of the doubt. Mm. Like, let's say they tell you that, like, like your your hand or somewhere, and you just like, nah, I'm gonna trust her. That's that's the dumbest thing I've ever done for love. For love, giving a hand the benefit of the doubt. Shoo, hello, loves, and welcome back to yet another TikTok trends segment with me, your local Zikagi. Before to this break up at this point, I feel like it did dangi show satan. Even the devil himself is in all your goodsy. Hi, bo, kwenzak alani. So it was ten past four, and already the house has uh, fallen. It's not even in the process of ukuwa. So bit by bit, the dots are connecting as to why the biggest prank star in south africa the almighty ghostly be neglected usima during their relationship now, according to close sources usima didn't want to compromise listen or be tamed by the almighty ghostly be sources say that usima loves having fun and her fun is actually being a full-time groovist and that ghost didn't like the idea of having a full-time girlfriend who parties every other day now the clip which i inserted for you guys after Sian Boji, a ghost is heard saying that the dumbest thing that he has ever done for a Han is giving them the benefit of the doubt. And fans already are of the view that he is referring uh, to the groovist Usima, as well as uh, a revelation that was made earlier on by Sian Boji that Usima is a cheater. Now, fans say that Ugo's Lubi was definitely talking about uh, that revelation made by Usian so that is why i actually did insert uh, both the videos for you guys to see now in daba esuzoi dingita is sima's graduation you guys that is that is why we are here and before i get into it i just want to insert the short video by usima which she posted earlier on before graduating so that everything can sort of like make sense i mind i've dropped out but at least i'm making money oh my oh my how i wish we could just all listen to those influencers when they talk to us you guys now before to i feel like it's getting good by the day while we were busy applauding the almighty ghostly before being mature during this breakup and being a man about it uh it does seem as though sima pressed the wrong buttons when she was busy releasing files on him after the video which they dropped on youtube for their breakup now there's a facebook account with over thirty-three thousand followers and is just out there to shade sima at first the page was all about you know love and light to both a ghost Luby and osima then after seeing that osima is exposing ghosts and has basically moved on has a new boyfriend then that is when the account also started to expose Osima. So guys, allegedly, according to this account, there was never a graduation for Osima. The account revealed this. This is what they said. Osima didn't graduate. Mara, you will not see me going live exposing her. <laughs> hey. Before to now, let me tell you something. When Sima fans uh, came for him uh, stating that this is, you are a better ex. He responded and said, okay, Oka graduated without a graduation belt. And went on to say, we actually bought the outfit and took pictures. Once again, the fans said that it is possible to graduate without a belt if you're graduating with a higher certificate. And that Sima probably took off the belt during pictures. Now, honestly speaking, you guys, when Usima took out those videos and pictures of graduation, fans were asking, they had a lot of questions, Oguti, if you really are graduating, then tell us where your parents are. We want to see pictures with your parents or your family or friends, even friends, you guys, you know, having a small Anyana celebration, but there was none of that. There was no celebration after Usima graduated. The Sima or Nemali, there was literally no celebration. No um, 
evidence of her family celebrating her. Furthermore, fans wanted to, uh, to understand, Wuti, where is the belt? Why are you not wearing your belt? And um, which degree and which institution did, did you go to? So as Umhlebi when you guys, there I was doing research on Usima and, you know, I found out to Wuti which college she went to and she was studying towards business management and all of these things. And I took out that video and congratulated her. And it literally does make sense because other fans were like, why does it look like you guys were at the mall? So when Uko Slubi says that we actually bought the gown and we paid the makeup artist just to go and, and shoot that video at the mall. So it actually does make sense, Uti. Yo, uh, uh, it, it didn't make any sense, Uti. Why would the family and friends not be there before it? So there you guys have it with this one. Some people are saying, you know, Ghost has literally stooped too low uh, for him to be releasing such files on Usima, even if that account is not entirely owned uh, by the almighty ghost people are believing that mhlambe uh, is telling the manager of the account ama secrets gasima you guys so what are your thoughts on this one please do just share that with me down on the comment section and i will surely be back with more updates thank you guys for joining me bye